We talked about Jordan being in the field, and there is a lot of fire. I'm sorry, but get out. That's a big hit. Oh, wow. oh my goodness. Wow. That was, he, he didn't know where he was. Yes. He couldn't see couldn't where see. he was, and he knew he had to get out. So lucky that he was able to get above the wall and out that door. Holy cow, that was dramatic. You saw it circled there. Yeah, doing a oh. great job. There's obviously an engine, and immediately goes up in flames. You can see there's flames. Looks like the flames inside the cab of the truck. Not as much driver's side. But you know he's got to be feeling the that inside. He's got the net down and is extricating himself. But look at this. He's out of the truck nearly. And that. Wow. It's been very humbling and very encouraging. Everybody that's reached out, prayed for me, and been there to help. My wife and I kind of get through this time and all the great doctors at Wake and UAE and NASCAR and everybody that's really taken care of me. I mean, we went to Wake last week and three, four weeks removed, and they said I'm at like the two-month mark as, well, as far as, I mean, my face and neck and my arms and just uh, definitely count my blessings. And they got hot, got hot quick in there. And, uh, you know, people probably thought I was crazy for jumping out of there, but that was the best scenario at that point was I didn't, didn't want to stay in there any longer. So just, just a crazy deal for sure.